uh, let's see this problem. In a farmhouse, there are some cows and hens. In all, there are 88 uh, heads and 226 legs. What is the difference between number of cows and hens? Uh, see, this problem can be solved very easily by method of allegation. Uh, in this question, uh, we are asked about the difference between cows and hens. Maybe the question is asked about the ratio of cows and hens. Maybe the question is uh, based on number of cows or maybe only number of hens, whatever, right? So the simplest method to solve this problem is the method of allegation, right? Now, how to use allegation over here? Just listen to me carefully. I assume, see, 88 heads are there. That means, that is fixed. That means, in all, there are 88 animals, right? Cows plus hens, in all, there are 88 animals. Now, what do I do? I assume all of them are hens. See, if 88 hens are there, if we count the legs, each hen will be having two legs. So, 88 into 2, 176 legs will be there, right? And uh, alternatively, what I assume, all of them are cows. Right now, each cow has four legs. So, in all, 88 into four, that is double of 176. Or we can say 352 legs will be there. But actual number of legs is somewhere in between. Right? That is 226. So, this uh, is the way uh, by which we can solve the problem. 352 minus 226. This is 126. 176, uh, I'm sorry, one, uh, 226 minus 176, that will be 50, right? So, that's 25, 63. 5 and 3, 8, 6 and 2, 8, okay? So, in all, these are 88 an, uh, animals. 25 are cows, 63 are hens. You want the difference between two? That's 38. Ratio is this. If you are asked about the number of cows, then that will be 25. A number of hens, that will be 63. And the difference is 38, right? So, how simply the problem can be solved by method of allegation? I hope you are clear.